Hey guys, Crown Jewel 602 coming to you guys with a fucking video. How long has it been? I missed ya. You missed me? I'm alive and here I am with a haul and also, you know, gift ideas for the makeup lover in your life. First palette, this is all palettes by the way. The Warrior 2, Juvia's Place. All mattes, here it is right here, $20. And this one is my least, um, no, second to least, because I hated the dual Dulce palette. Um, it's just, it's a great addition to someone who is, because it's matte and they're the blend out transition, uh, addition colors. But I would never wear this palette on its own. If I had to in a pinch, I would, but there it is. And it's all right. It's all right. I'm not going to hate on it. The next palette is the new, just dropped, uh, Urban Decay Cherry. This one is giving me... Um, Anastasia Beverly Hills Renaissance modern Renaissance vibes but there it is nice mirror comes with the brush the brush is actually clear in the middle which is a toss uh, which is a switch up from what they normally do but these colors are great and nice and if you like these sort of berry sweet romantic tones this palette is for you that is between 40 and 50 dollars next palette is another Too Faced this is in the chocolate family this is the uh, chocolate uh, Too Faced chocolate gold okay and I love the packaging where it looks dipped it and also it looks like a lot of those um what is that makeup revolution but mm, it smells like chocolate there it is I was immediately drawn to this color your girl has one of these colors on her eyes today I got that one in my inner corner and it looks fantastic love this palette um love the way it smells i like the colors in it i feel like it's nice i don't feel gypped 40 to 50 bucks again and i don't feel gypped that i have it next palette this is one of this is my first huda beauty palette this is the huda obsessions this one's like 25 or 28 dollars but it's all the red and berry shades i have been loving on this little palette this is nine eyeshadows nine small eyeshadows that i have been loving and she does happen to give you a mirror loving all of these shades been wearing these type of colors with other things mixed in all week just to fit this in um she has a green one um a gold one a purple one uh yeah she's got a bunch um this one i am loving and i love it for the purpose that it was made for i feel but this is the urban decay born to run palette love the packaging see how small it is it's like a little book it says born to run on it love it okay these are these this is for travel the mirror is huge the palette is great you can take it day night pops of color great 40 to 50 bucks love that palette this one is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina. As you guys can see, it's that velvet, like the modern renaissance. Already got a little bit dirty, but I have used it. Actually, one of the colors, this one, I'm wearing, actually two. These two, I'm wearing on my eyes today. Love this palette. Used it. Quality's great. Don't. This palette I bought for the packaging, I'm not even going to lie. I don't need any of these colors in here. Anastasia Beverly Hills Sultry Palette great look at it this is a night palette but they'll get you because this packaging is super sparkly and wonderful and the outside packaging is too the only box i kept from this recent haul last palette i'm going to show you guys is the Too faced gingerbread palette this one smells like cookies absolutely wonderful love it don't feel gypped by any of the colors in it and i have been loving it okay so that is all of the palettes that I have bought recently been loving them if you want to see an in-depth video on any of them perhaps the Urban Decay um, cherry palette I'll do that one or the born to run or the Huda Beauty but it's it's old it's like you know a few months old so everybody's done that video but just let me know if you got any comments comment down below below don't forget to subscribe to this video sorry I'm talking so fast but I'm actually late i got people waiting downstairs because i'm going out tonight i did a little fake cut crease you guys are wondering um yeah feeling it the foundation i'm wearing is oldie but goodie and it's black opal and there it is i'm out the door guys hey until next time peace youtube